fire, the mega roller coaster in the Europa Park is made of steel. But some fun seekers prefer things more old fashioned. So the boss wondered why not build a roller coaster out of wood? We have all kinds of steel roller coasters, whether it's a ratcheted climber, a linear drive vehicle, or a looping formation. But a wooden roller coaster has tradition. The Mack company used to build wooden roller coasters. The year my father was born, my grandfather built the first wooden roller coaster for traveling carnivals, and later also for Scandinavian parks. <laughs> And now his grandson is realizing the dream of having carpenters and fitters build a roller coaster by hand. A technical masterpiece. When it's finished, it will be 35 meters tall. Nothing here is prefabricated apart from the nuts and bolts and threaded rods. Those are the only things that we don't make by hand. Does he enjoy his work? Yes, because you're not one of 200,000. Here you're one of 20 in all of Germany, and that's cool. The carpenters have to be able to climb as well as work with wood. There is no scaffolding here. Ropes are used for security and transport. Everything is custom made in accordance with the engineer's instructions. When full, the cars will weigh up to 12 tons, which the wood has to be able to support. The wooden roller coaster will cross paths with other roller coasters in the Europa Park. This is a good piece of engineering, and what the carpenters are doing is wonderful, building it all of wood. Everything's been done on site. We have wood ready, and every hole that's drilled, every nail that's hammered, everything that's needed to assemble this wooden roller coaster is happening right here. The foundation is poured concrete, as are parts of the station. For the track, spruce from northern Germany is used. The ride will be more than a kilometer long, take 20 seconds, and move at well over 100 kilometers an hour. But wood expands, contracts, and warps, and so must be regularly inspected. My father always said, stay away from wooden tracks or you'll be in the workhouse, and to a degree he was right. The wood is impregnated, the moisture has been removed from it, and there's only 16 percent residual moisture, and that greatly influences the shrinking behavior. We used a new technology of track construction, but it's clear to us that we'll need two or three carpenters on staff to constantly tighten screws that loosen from the tracks. But first, the track has to be completed. The weather is still good, but winter is approaching and will hamper building efforts. So the craftsmen are under pressure. The roller coaster is scheduled for completion in April of 2012. The combination of high tech and wood will cost about 10 million euros. And the Europa Park will be one attraction richer.